that you're looking for three DIY brain games for your dog. This is a perfect opportunity if you're at home all day and you wanna keep your dog engaged. It's also great if you're leaving for the day it's a way to keep them busy so they're not doing anything destructive if you have them out roaming around the house. The first one, you take a cookie sheet with a tennis ball here. You put the kibble inside and then you put the tennis ball on top and then your dog finds the kibble after lifting up the ball. I'm gonna give a demonstration of each one of these at the end of the video, so be sure to check it out. The very next one is essentially, you take some type of empty container. Here we got our PB2 with an old t-shirt that you don't mind ripping up. There are a few different ones that I've seen online where basically you put the lid on top of it and then you cut holes in the side so then the kibble will fall out whenever it, your dog's pushing it around. I don't like that idea and the reason why, I mean, I actually tried it here at the top and then I, I just kind of stopped because it was way too rough. So if you have your Boston Terrier licking on this, it's gonna cut its tongue for sure. And even on the sides here, if you cut a little hole in the side, your Boston's gonna put its tongue in it. So I wouldn't recommend that. Instead, what you're gonna do is you take just an old t-shirt, put it over the top of the opening, and then at the bottom, you're just gonna tie it off in a knot and poke a hole right here in the top. And then your Boston's gonna be able to play with that. And then as the kibble falls out, it's fine. They're not gonna end up gnawing on it or chewing on it where it's gonna hurt their teeth or at least they shouldn't gnaw or chew on the plastic. The next one, it's essentially, well, not essentially, it is an egg carton. What you're gonna do is put kibble in the egg carton. You're gonna show this to your dog, and then they're gonna go to town trying to open it up. So I'll give a demonstration for each of these three ones. So basically, once again, an egg carton, some type of old container, old jar that's plastic with an old T-shirt. You're gonna cinch it off, poke a hole in the top, and they're gonna be able to enjoy that. And what everybody has in their home, a muffin pan with a tennis ball. If you have multiple tennis balls, you put them through here. So those are three free ways to create your own brain game for your Boston Terrier. Now, whenever I got to thinking about this, as far as your Boston, you know, using your in-home DIY type stuff, I was like, would that make Bella more likely to tear up things because she thinks there's food in it? because you know, using your Amazon boxes and putting food in it as a way to for them to get into it. So I, I wouldn't recommend using Amazon boxes because you're gonna have those all the time. And I think if you start showing your boss and that it's okay to tear up those boxes because there's food in it, it could cause issues. So stick to things like egg cartons, which you know you're not gonna be having laying around the house. Same with muffin pans, those aren't gonna be lying around the house. So keep it to those type of uh, items that aren't just laying around everywhere. Let's keep that in mind. Okay, so we have all three of the toys lined up. This one we have the, the shirt over the cup with a little hole cut into it. Next we have our egg carton with a little bit of kibble in it. Bella's loving it. And then of course, our muffin pan with a tennis ball with some kibble in there. I would recommend only doing one at a time. And you definitely wanna show it to your dog for the very first time. If they're not used to this, this is the first time I've ever done this with Bella. Thought it'd be interesting to do as a video. So come here, Bella. Come here, Bella. And so, for instance, for the egg carton. Bella, look, Bella, you're free. So then, I think she, she just woke up from a nap, so she's really excited. In theory, they're gonna love this, and they're gonna play with it. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you want more information about Boston Terriers and you love the breed, be sure to click subscribe. If you want to join a community of other Boston Terrier owners, be sure to join the Boston Terrier Society Facebook group. A link is in the show notes below to get you to that spot. And I will catch you guys on the next video. Thanks. Have a great day.